my gosh, you can see Bo back there. Boy, hi. Well, welcome to a house update video. We're gonna be doing um, our floors this week, so we've got a lot to figure out. Uh, Chase and I went to Home Depot this morning. Um, went and looked around. I'll insert that now. The Benson Park, but it looks like it's picking up a lot of gray. So we're thinking porcelain tile. Why? Because it's sturdy? Oh, bomb proof. Bomb proof. Engineered hardwood. You don't want like normal kind of tiles, you want. Yeah. So we gotta get like. And nine dollars a piece. Yep. Well, we, we buy it in bulk, we oh, okay. Um, so we ended up going with porcelain tile for our flooring. Um, in the majority of the upstairs of the house. We didn't really find any kind that we like at Home Depot. Um, mostly because the planks, like the actual planks, um, just look a little too narrow for my liking. So I'm gonna go take Bo to the new house so he can go frolic around in the backyard. Um, today is Friday, January 7th. So, oh my gosh, look at the mountains. Oh, that is insane. I always, um, <laughs> I always, whenever I talk to Chase, I'm like, can you believe we live here? Like, wow, look at those mountains. And he obviously grew up here in Utah, so he's like, yeah, come on, mountains. Like, we live around mountains, but oh, my gosh, it's beautiful. Um, gonna drop Bo off at the new house and then head to Floor and Decor to see if I can find some better porcelain tile planks that I would like better for our flooring in the main floor. And then after I do that, I'll go back to the new house and hang out and I'll give you guys like a house update on how things are and where we are with a lot of the projects. So, cut to floor and decor. Um, so this is kind of what I'm looking to do in the entryway of the house. Oh, this one's kind of got like a snakeskin situation. Um, but something like this, like maybe a honeycomb with the dark grout. Hmm. This is pretty much exactly what I'm looking for. I just am not crazy about the 9 by 47. That's exactly what we saw at Home Depot. And I just don't know if I love that look. Okay, well I'll buy, let me buy one of these boxes and then I'll ask them if I can also, they can check and see if I have enough for 1100 square feet. Get some natural light on it. You really like it? Yeah. It's like just honestly just light enough and just dark enough. Like perfect. Everyone keep kind of came, like was walking up to me and they're like, do you need help? And I was like, no. Another guy, do you need any help? No, no, because I like, couldn't make my mind up. And then finally, I like, tried to lift this box of my own, and the guy came back and was like, do you need help? And I was like, can you lift this for me? <laughs> he was like, yep. Because <laughs> like, I knew you were going to need help sooner or later. I love it. Okay. So, first update, we put in this wall here and 
there was a wall here. No, there was a railing here, right here. And so we framed it all in. Um, this wall was here already. So kind of just bear with me as I'm trying to explain the layout here. We put in this doorway and this wall, this whole wall is new. And this is going to be an office. It used to be like this little sitting room area. There wasn't a wall here though. And then we put in this closet. So yeah, it's gonna be an office and we've already got all the can lights put in, which makes a huge difference, I think. And then, so you walk out of the office and there's gonna be a wall here but you turn this way and then you walk into the master bedroom. So this is the master. Um, right when you come in, you can turn left and this will take you to the master closet, which is gonna have can lights and LED put into it as well. Right now it's kind of a mess, but this will all be closet, all on this wall, closet, all the way to over here, closet, closet, closet. Wish to kind of give you a little bit of like bearings, like the office doors right there. We just walked in this hallway. There's the entry. <laughs> and so here's the master closet. And then over here is going to be the master bathroom, which we're still coming up with a plan. Or we kind of have it, but none of it's laid out. We've got to move a lot of plumbing. There's going to be a wall that goes up somewhere in here for a guest bathroom also. But I'll explain that a little bit better. Wow, that one flew all the way over here. Okay. Excuse me. Okay, so when you leave the master bedroom, we're coming down here. So again, you walk in, office, master bedroom. So then when you leave, staircase is there. You can come up here. This is the kitchen, obviously, that needs a lot of work. I've gone paint swatch crazy over here. Um, this is going to need a lot of work, but we are also doing this as well. So we still have to demo everything. Um, across from the kitchen, we have our nice big new living room area. So before, you can kind of see in the floor here, there was a wall and this was a, bath or a bedroom. But we took that wall down and took out those closets just to make it one big room. Here's Bo. Hey, Bo. Um, so, yeah. And then right off of it, we have two doorways here. One right here. This is just going to be our pantry, actually. We're taking out all of this HVAC. And is this pipe plumbing? This PB, PVC pipe? PVC is a... No, it's not plumbing. It's a air vent. Air vent. So both of these are HVAC. We're taking those out. This is going to be a little pantry. And then this is the entryway for a little half bath for guests whenever we have them come visit. Um, we're just going to do a little pedestal sink in here and a toilet somewhere. And then the, this is a master bathroom that I just talked about, but there's going to be a wall, obviously, separating the two. So that's what we got going on right now. Still quite the <laughs> production, but at least we have floors figured out now, which we do like the ones that I just got from Floor & Decor. So hi, Bo. <laughs> Bo's too scared to step on the new floor, he just jumps over it. 
He just jumped over it. <laughs> Coming along. Oh, and we got all of the lights put in here as well. So all the electrical's done for the most part. We put in all of these can lights, these can lights, these can lights. So, yeah. The general contractor himself with no facial hair. Yeah, I don't know. It's a different vibe. Okay, I came out here to shut the doors to the barn and might as well show you the view Back to the old work site. Let's see if it's still pretty hot. Mmm. Hi, Bo. All right. This room is done. Work in progress. But we're laying our cement boards. Backer boards. afternoon yeah it's 1 15 Saturday January 8th and I am in South Salt Lake I just as you saw had some brunch did some wedding planning in this new like pretty cool like Western plant-based cafe I had a um, god darn god darn God darn breakfast burrito, but it was spelled weird, I don't know. But anyways, it was really, really good. So now we are heading to, I'm in Chase's big ass, whoa, big ass truck. And we are heading to uh, floor and decor, take two. Um, they didn't have enough of the floor that I liked um, yesterday. They didn't have enough there, like in store for what I need. So now I'm in South Salt Lake trying to back out huh. oh my god this is okay i'll see you guys at floor to floor Bye. me trying to park this truck is like literally almost a joke but anyways we made it to floor and decor this one is so much bigger than the one in draper holy crap okay so i found our one that we looked at yesterday the township beige and it looks like they have enough of it too so I'm just going to stand here and look confused until someone comes and helps me. Okay. I've got to back up in front of all these people. <gasps> okay. Okay, I don't even put my seatbelt on. Okay. <clears throat> oh, everyone's looking at me. <laughs> cool. Okay. minutes. Flow and decor pick up. It's amazing they don't have a garage. Oh really? Yeah. Oh my gosh, we'll see. Yay. I think it's fine. Oh no, maybe not. 
No, I don't, mm, no, I don't think so. Oh, hi, Bo. You did it fast. Um, this is an outside piece. Yeah. Broken. Okay. So just tell them. Okay, so we just unloaded the first round of all the flooring and now I have to go back to floor and decor and get the second round of it because it was too heavy for one load. So, back downtown. Gosh. Okay, so this is the last of it. Look how low Chase's truck is to the ground. Holy shoot. It's the last of it. It's all the flooring. Hell yeah. Is this one scoop in? Yeah. That is really cool. Two huge bucks roaming around our neighborhood. Yeah, there is a big old family of deer that live in here. Okay. I'm just gonna chill. Finish journaling, finish um, looking up some master bath stuff, and then I need to tidy and then get rid of all this stuff, put it in my car. It's actually all supposed to go to the new office for my job. So I just need to get it out of the way. We are headed to the new house to start work again. I've got my iPad, I've got the New granola bars Chase got me. And yeah, we're just gonna head to the new house and get going. It's Sunday, January 9th. And it's a lovely day. I'll show you the mountains. I mean, wow. It's a little chilly out today. You can see the frost. You definitely look the part today. Yeah. With your toolbox and your flannel. I've been for three days. Yeah. I've been wearing for three days. Same pants. We've both been wearing the same exact pants for this whole weekend. I finally get why you have like a stack of pants that are like not dirty but not clean. Like these yeah. pants are they're definitely, definitely dirty, but dirty. They're not dirty enough to not wear them. Again exactly. Because we're about to do the exact same shit all over again today. So, anyways. It's so loud in there, so I'm coming out here really quick. So you know how I was just cleaning up the floor for the backer board? Well, we decided to actually just rip this one out, so. That is what I'm doing now. Good morning. <laughs> um, It's now, Monday morning, I'm up, dressed, I tanned last night, it felt so good. Um, having some coffee, but you remember, I'll show you, you remember the, ugh, I got laundry to do, so much laundry, I gotta tidy everything up today, but do you remember how <laughs> yesterday I was like, I need to clean, I need to move all of these boxes, which are now moved, except for this one, because this, um, it's actually not for my job. It's not for my, the office at all. Um, it's our new, um, what's well, supposed to be our new sink, our new pedestal sink from the, for the house. Just listen, just, I mean, it is like in pieces. So I'm gonna open it up just to assess the damage. I got it from this company called Rejuvenation and that's also where we were gonna get a bunch of our hardware, but I'm like scared. Oh. Yeah, I mean, God bless. Okay, I just bit the bullet and opened it up. This is what Looks like, just, just such a shame. Uh, okay, 
Okay, so since I really do have so much real life work to catch up on, I'm gonna end this video here and then start a new one tomorrow. Start with the house update tomorrow and then get into like another weekly vlog with my wedding dress try on and things. So, I um, hope you enjoyed <laughs> this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what Chase and I got up to this weekend and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.